Hello, I'm Ed Trism, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, as independent India. Right, uh, we are currently about to go to war with China. Oh, hello, why are you on? And we're going to be doing our best to uh, try and grab as many things as possible to be able to go, look, we could participate in the war. We're good. We're questioning the motives of China. There is no doubt that China is preparing for war. Uh, the change in economic policy will make it plain to see that the Chinese are not people of peace. But are rather waiting for the right opportunity to strike against us. Uh, well, they are at war, but, you know, whatever. I mean, they've got more people on this board than we did. Uh, about a minute ago. What I might do... Because we need to be able to push as quickly as possible. Is... Edit. We'll reduce our frontage. Because if we go up there as well... Yeah. I don't mind them striking down a little bit because they're going to lose. Like, it's not a question of, you know, if they're going to be able to beat us. It's a question of how much will they be able to push in here if we actually go to war. Because Japan's going to beat the crap out of them. And instead of doing this push, I think we should do a push straight for this because it's their capital right now. And here, because technically we'll be at war with you as well, because I think we'll get dragged into something, because you've got an alliance or faction, or... Yeah, you've got a faction. You're both in the Chinese United Liberated thing. Am I right? Chinese United Front, that's the one. You actually allow me to join your faction. That would be funny. Okay. Head to the front line. You've not got long. I think you've got like 15 days. No, less than that. How's research going? Good. Now, when we get mountain infantry, I actually want to start making mountain infantry. So, I'm going to stop doing a few of you. One, two, uh, yes, you're still the lowest. Three. And... Four. Lowest, uh, XP is the most important part. Okay, and we'll put reinforcements back to medium. Good. Uh, motorized is coming forwards. That's a justification for war. Um, still a couple of lagging... Units. Oh, hello. Feel free to join. Right. Declare war. Push. And you are on aggressive. Yeah, I want you on aggressive at the moment. There we go. People's Republic of China just joined in. Uh, what's that? A non aggression pact? With Japan? Yes, that'll be useful actually. All right, we need to crack this front so we can start rolling and pushing as fast as possible. I'll tell the motorized division that they're the high reinforcement of priority. And then we're going to start training some mountaineer divisions. Um, four. Or four. That seems reasonable. could deploy these, but it's too risky. Like, they won't have the, all the bonuses and stuff that we really want from the extra uh, XP. Right. Uh, what do we want here? You're ahead of time. Computing machine. Minus 3% research time. No, third. Minus 3% research time, but also it leads us to decryption and encryption. Yeah, we'll grab that. Menkuko. I'm in decline. I think Menkuko is a puppet of Japan, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, pop it, so it doesn't matter. Like, I don't need to have an immigration pack with you. They're defending very well here. Ah, mountains. Extremely hot. Hmm. It's too hot to fight. Fort Infantry. 
6 to 14 infantry. Yeah, it's just infantry, really, right around here. Uh, how many, like, artillery we've got? 30. Nah, no, that's not enough to roll out. That's enough for, like, one division. Okay. We'll get there. No. Straight up. You need to keep pushing. For a start, this is victory point. But also, it allows to maybe encircle them. Uh, d certainly allows to push onwards. Start engaging over there. I'm say they're holding a little bit better than I expected. Southern China, they've got fighters up, we've got closer support. Yeah, so we're going to start suffering a little bit there. Fine, I can't really afford to do anything else. We bypassed motorization effort. Cool, we got a bonus. Oh, for motorized, it only applies to motorized. Ah, we shouldn't have got motorized yet. Uh, I thought this would be motorized and mechanized, but fine. Uh, we got the army effort, which is nice. For us, using unit technology, we should follow this development. It was very early. We'll get a doctrinal effort. Actually, I was going to say we should probably check on the number of factories if we've got 50, but too late now. Uh, we also need to have a look at our mountainous divisions. Yeah. Combat with the six. Way not good enough. We could go 10, but I'm just going to go all the way up for now. 20, which is the standard width I go for. Uh, we might, in future, put some artillery in there, but for now we don't actually have enough artillery. Like, this uses 24. I think artillery in here uses 36. Wow. Pushing here is slow. Okay, they're backing up, which is nice. No, certainly don't fall back. Let them fall back, and then we're going to take the sand. Support weapons. Right, one of you go here. fact, I want like three of them going around there. You join in to get the extra bonus. Research. Ooh, choices, choices, choices. I think what we're going to do is start on the uh, land doctrines. And I know people have said, oh, we've actually got the stuff. Uh, superior firepower. Oh, you need like factories and stuff for that. We'll have factories. Don't worry. We're going to capture land and the captured land will contain factories. We're also going to build load ourselves. So we will be able to do that. Uh, we could go for the artillery bonus. That's off limits at the moment. Uh, actually, we're going to go for logistics company. We will want that. It will cost us a little bit in terms of uh, when we motorized, along with supplies, but we will want it. Uh, yes, right, we've actually grabbed that. So now they're off limits. Full of Nanjing. A significant development. Mm-hmm. Wait, what's this capital for? Was it Nanjing? I didn't expect it to be Nanjing, but I'm pretty sure this was their capital. No, it wasn't. It was uh, just a big town. Oh, well, that was a good assumption. It was going to flip to here anyway, because it's the only big... It's only a city they've got left. Like, they've got... This is pretty big. These are pretty big. But that is the key. We're going to keep that momentum up. In fact, yeah, we're all going to keep that momentum up. Two attack that way. One's going to stay to hold the position. Mm. 
I was actually going to flank under if you'd stayed there a little bit longer, but okay. I've got to say, this is one tough cookie. Alright, one of you just keep the pressure up on you. One of you start sneaking around here. I'm going to try this around. Oh, they found reinforcements. Yeah, we'll hold for the moment. Actually, no, we'll support here. They need the support. Oh, hello. We'll try and do that, but they're going to stop us, which is fine because I need to prevent them from taking over. And repositioning. Four units here. No, we want them near the front line. Don't know what they're doing all the way back there. The only thing is they've got a lot of units so they can cover this frontage, whereas I'm having difficulty. Come on, you win that. I believe in you. Oh, hello. Yeah, we're going to need someone to come around here and defend this. Okay. Modify government. What do we want? Um, military theorist? Experience gain, land auction time. Yeah. Japan's doing pretty well. Our offensive has kind of stalled a little bit. Let's decrease this front line again. Aha, four fresh units. Just what we need. We're attacking them? No, don't. This way. And then you attack here. You attack here as well. I'm going to do a pincer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure they managed to do that, but... We're going to help. How are we doing on the training of everyone else? Uh, you're coming. You're doing good. Why have we got five? We don't need five. Anschluss of Austria. Doctrine effort. Poland seeks Baltic cooperation. Ooh. Uh, and that should spike the amount we've got of motorized in these. Because the one we just rolled out got rid of the motorized. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, yeah, we have enough factories. Sweet. Do the extra research slot. Please, 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 please. please. It's really amazing. Make sure we cut that off. Superior firepower. Which gives a soft attack plus 20%. Then let's go for organization for leg infantry plus 10. Overrun. Yes! We don't need to attack you anymore. We just need to get here.
Right, you move into here. You're moving to there. You move to here. They'll probably get there first. You try and flank around. Flank up, flank up, and get down. Ah, uh, there we go. Expecting them to do something like this. Yeah, they're trying to... Uh... Oh, hello, Ethel. Uh, yeah, they're trying to crush this unit again. Ooh, we are suffering from steel issues. Uh, hey there, Japan. I mean, we're somewhat buddy-buddy right now. Actually, don't defeat that unit. Leave it alive, because it might run out into this hole, and I don't want that to happen. Okay, there we go. Winning that. It's vaguely happening. I'm going to get rid of that front line because I don't actually want them to attack this. I want them to leave the pocket. And then... Ah! Right. Uh, yes. One division. Not exactly. We'll, we'll sort that. Uh... Why? What? Why are you going like that? I have no idea why they're trying to go here. There we go. Eight divisions are assigned to this one, which means that four here are assigned to the push, in theory. Control right click to select assign units. Put them all in there. No, Menkoko, I don't want your non-aggression pact. It's boring. We can get to their capital. Right, those four, just push. Got another one recruited. Seriously, when are we going to get the cool stuff? Ooh, very shortly. Just need a little bit more motorized. And we're going to get you very shortly as well. Sweet. I keep pushing that front line. Let's check the world briefly. Okay, nothing crazy going on. Didn't think there would be anything crazy going on. Not for now, at least. Okay. Yeah, okay. This seems like a pretty worthwhile uh, goal. Ooh, yes! I'm so happy. Why? No, don't go there. All the four of you rush to the capital. Come on, pull this around. Pull the surround out. Extra research slot. Oh yeah. Right, what do we do with the extra research slot? Um we'll grab that for the leg inventory soft tech plus five cent. And then for this, we'll grab armament two, which gives us a building factory thing. Montov ribbon truck pack, that's gonna go so well. So Germany and the Soviet Union are like, yeah, cool, we'll be buds. Let's 
so many mountains. It's so slow going over here. We'll manage it. Yes. To keep the momentum up, we'll be pinning this here. Eighty-five, taking multiple directions. Come on, you got this. France bans communism. Okay, France, why have you banned communism? It's actually not that powerful. It's a shame. Rain. The rain in France falls mostly on the important battles around Paris. Uh, oh, come on, you can do it. No, don't fall back. Don't fall back. God damn it. There's so many units going in here. 95. We've got the capital. Right, these two continue up to here, so we've got a way to attack you. In fact, no. Go for this. We want to get the victory points over here. That was worth 10. Where did your capital go to? Over here? Interesting. That doesn't actually... That's just a random province. That's not even a... Wow, okay. So close towards Pitchling. So close. Okay. Surround didn't really work. Just took way too long to go through this unit. That said, we're still going to get three units here. Yeah, we're never going to get that. Japan's just going way too fast. Trying to capitulate it. Oh, hello. Alright, what can I grab? I can't. Ah! I most importantly, I have to grab these, like, really rich promises first. And turn. No! Fine. It happens. And turn. And turn. Why is this gone? I don't know. Pass. Pass. And turn. There we go. We're cut off from it. But it's got most of the resources. They had resources there, but we didn't manage to grab that either. We took 22 states. Uh, sorry. Japan took 22 states. We took 5. I'd say that's reasonable. Let's look at the resources there. Yeah, so we didn't manage to get the 2024, but we did get the 1024, the 2024, the 1410 And we didn't manage to join it up with the mainland, but... Oh well. I wonder if the Japanese are willing to trade. Um, ask for land. No? Oh. Right, so. We'll touch that 100%. Hee hee hee. Whoopsie. I'm wondering who we try and attack next. My, my want to attack Siam. Iraq wouldn't be a bad fallback, but I want to attack Siam. I think we declare against Iraq. And you might be like, wait, wait didn't you just say Siam? We declare against Iraq so that they go to guarantee Iraq and then we use Siam as our actual punching bag. They might guarantee both. 
In which case, you know, whatever. Uh, we can always, you know, attack more people just for funsies. We could attack some of the ones up here just for the land. We could go for Turkey. Oh, that would be a that'd be a tough fight, but they're not a bad choice. They've got a good industry that I'd want. Ooh, free military factories! Yay! Uh, two more of you. Two more of you. One of you. Wow, that's a lot of guns needed. Really? Okay. And we're gonna have to start on support command. Right. So what we do, we're going to move our army to here. It doesn't matter where our army is. But we'll declare on Iraq. But that'll be next episode. If you've enjoyed, please leave a like. If not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Sadly, we didn't manage to connect them up. But we did get a whole load of stuff. And that's what I'm pleased about. If we hadn't grabbed these first, I'm sure Japan would have grabbed them. And we've got all but one of the most resource-intensive provinces for China. And that is going to help us massively. Because it means we no longer need to trade. Hi. Yeah, I don't need that anymore. Look at the surplus, surplus tungsten. Oh, so good. Uh, but yeah. Till next episode. Stay shiny.